Hi everyone, in this video I'm going to explain how FreeMCE calculates the allowable story drift. Now if you are using FreeMCE, you will notice that the program will ask the user to declare the allowable story drift as H over a number and this in this example it's 450 it depending on the the code requirement now what this means is that the displacement must be less than the ratio of the height over 450 so the height could be the total height of the building but in this case the D must correspond to the total displacement at the top level. Now you can also interpret this as the ratio of the floor height over the displacement within that floor. So in case of um, allowable story drift, then FreeMCE calculates the floor level displacement and then compare it with the requirement. Now, talking about soft story, soft story means that the stiffness at a particular level, I mean the, the stiffness of the columns at a particular level is much slower than the stiffness of the columns above and below of that level and I'm going to show you an example of this later in this video okay so I will demonstrate how friends he does um, the calculation or the analysis okay this is uh, the, the frame I've shown earlier in another video now I will run the analysis and then check the story drift now I have to declare which load keys I need to include in the calculation and in the latest version you have the option of um, selecting either to have a report of the analysis or not so I will check this and then Primzy will give a report after the analysis and then click OK and then it says that it's safe so FreeMCE will provide a report of the story drift calculation okay it takes a bit of time but um I hear okay so frame ce will give a report as you can see the all pass it will give frame ce will give the displacement of its floor and columns and compare it with the allowable um, floor displacement now what if see I will change the requirement if see I will change this to 550 and then provide a report now there is failure and then as indicated by this read um, columns and I have to wait for the report and it's here so now frame CE um, will generate a report of all the displacements and the columns and columns that failed are indicated by read and then also the report in its column text will have read 
uh, read the fonts if uh, the color I mean the the column field in that um, for the lateral displacement within that story okay see here now I'm going to show you what this um, I, I will I will come back here and then see pop 50 okay now it's it's safe now if I will change this to say for example a, a smaller valley I mean section okay I will change this to this one and then run the analysis and then if I'm going to show the displacement what you can see here is a, a soft story here you can see that you can clearly see that the displacement at the third level is much higher than the displacement of the other floors so this is a like this is what you call a soft story and then if you check the displacement report then clearly it shows here that frame ce can detect that this is a soap story as indicated by a failure uh, in the third level columns and frame ce will generate a report for this um, I have to wait for the report okay here see here this is the the failed column displacement due to the sub story um, columns or uh, sub story I mean uh, in that uh, uh, for this particular level okay see here hmm. all the read all these read columns are shown in this read um, um, text report for this um, column key okay, here so now there is another interesting um, way of checking for the sub story now this is by way of um, frequency analysis you can see here if I will run um, I will I mean I will change this to the original size and this one apply and this and if I will run the frequency analysis okay what you can see is that the mode uh, mode one of the frequency is like this it's very smooth and you can see that there is no sub story okay but if I will change these columns here to the much smaller section and then run the frequency analysis and then you can see here the effect of the sub story you can see that the movement the movement starts from this soft story and this is very flexible and this is one way of checking for sub story columns okay and then you can also okay exit 
and i hope you learned from this example and if you have any questions don't hesitate to contact me